a great Sorry. position to force them back. So Granville is waiting for some artillery to be recruited and sent to him to Ready. help support the push. I want to send right now, because I'm not at war with peace, I'm not at the war with Spain, sorry. All three of these armies will push north to Paris and then immediately start to fight against Brussels and Strasbourg. As that starts to go well, maybe I might expand, expand, expand my army up here to go take Munich. And when this army is replenished, I'd like to send them to go and lay siege to Vienna, potentially. I'd want to keep a bit of a barrier between me and Poland. Um, because I want to see them develop and expand. Well, according to this, Poland... Oh no, according to this, we beat Poland. Not Russia, though. Um, all my research has been... has been decided. I need to upgrade my Mediterranean fleet, really. Waiting for your order. As my rake to creeps towards Sicily to blow their brains out. Just like what I'm attempting to do... what I'm attempting to do in the Americas as well. But things are going well, in general. Russia's destroying the Ottoman Empire, so they're going to be quite the threat. Um, but right now, my real problem is, is my weak navy is not being able to hold its own. Um, my small navy in the Caribbean is doing a sterling job of holding down significantly larger forces but my army in the, in the Mediterranean is almost non-existent barring two second rate ships of the line so what I need to do is strengthen that I think that's the priority when I start off this turn is to get a few more ships being built in Toronto There is a port in this region that has not yet been developed. Select the type of port to construct. So whether it's always, always the best thing to do, um, I always like to upgrade the whatever she's telling me to upgrade, just so that she changes her mind the next time. Let's put another second ray and let's build a two, three third ray ships of the line. That will start to put some first rates when the next port is upgraded. When the next level port has been Your upgraded. Humble servant. Where are you going? Yes, my lord. My lord? Everyone's being replenished. My lord. Immediately! No. The Granville. Where's the artillery being built as well? Ah, Genoa. Up you go. Also go to join Granville. It's useful we've got a couple of the turn. Ah, oh, I've spent all my money. Spent all my money here. Spent all my money here and I've not spent it in the Americas. So just upgrading this Weaver's Cottage. So let's get our three first rates, including an Admiral, down to the Bahamas. Just to strengthen our blockade of the Leeward Islands. Ready and waiting. Some elite ships. Watch out! It's Captain Montgomery. Raritan. Pretty sure these, some a bunch of these are captured ships. Spend a bit more money on replenishing some troops at Zagreb. Whatever I can manage to replenish. Text turned on one more turn. Just make sure that text. Let's check my ministers. So he's not great considering how much income I'm probably making from Europe. I'll try boot Francis Hale first. Is it? No, let's go for. Sorry, Bobby. Oh no. Zachariah's even worse. Although I'm still earning 38,000 a turn, or 39,000, so that's not too bad. So this Austrian stack keeps moving around this pass. I wanted to get close enough so I can intercept it. Um, it's turn. Hiding. 
Oh, the British are going to invade someone. Watch them invade France and take Paris right from under my nose. Ability on my troops massing across the river. But it won't help them when I march north. Do you have that Polish navy blockading me in the Western Atlantic? The Poles are finally Iroquois territory. Territory. Oh, but they now have a border with us. So the question is, do I pull back from Croatia, Croatia and just spend a bit of time defending in Venice against the Poles? Because I really do want to fight them. I don't want to, I don't want to win. I don't want to beat them. Well, I want to win the battle, but I don't want to beat them yet. There is a port I want them to just stay. That has not yet been developed. Let's go to Ravenna. Let's upgrade you to an actual school. So I fall back now. I mean, Austria might just take it. Okay, I'm actually going to build walls in Croatia now. Just hold on to it for a little bit. Send one of these sloops to Nice. Still ship shape. Your humble servant. Okay, you says you're replenishing, but you should be done. It's Amadeus. You could do with more artillery than you got, but Forward. waiting further march, Forward. march out. For crown and country. Ready for order, sir. It's gonna be a bit isolated from Granville from for support. Forward. For crown yes, my lord. Country. Immediately. March up the river road up march. onto this hill. Good stuff. Magic. Jeremy Jones with your dragoons. Let's do some march scouting. March. Anything more? Pick up the Weaver's Cottage. Yes, sir. Good. I actually still have some money left over. Can't recruit any decent sized ships with it, though. Let's replenish those forces in, in Philly. I should next turn spend money in Cuba, because we are not maximizing our. Profits from Cuba. Go on. Oh, we got him! We got him. Good. So we'll start to convert um, Naples. Oh, they're going to try and run around us. Enemy fleet ahead. I mean, withdraw. Beat the retreat. Making camp. It is tempting to send Hamilton northeast to cover those bridges. Because if Amadeus is going for, which he is going to go for, go go for Paris. I want someone to block off an easy route. Are they are they at war with Austria? I think they are. Um, but I want to block off an easy route to my Italian territories. Bold, very bold. Georgians returning back. It's obviously interesting. It's nice to see Denmark still alive as there well. There is a port in this region that Gallery has not school. yet been developed. So okay, so I've got the port. I'm not going to touch this yet. Okay. Trade port. Commercial basin. You're getting roads. New sugar plantation. New tobacco plantation. Craft workshop, so you should be growing by a significant amount. Okay, my Mediterranean fleet is growing nicely. Yes. So I want Hamilton to be here. Line for battle. That way he can maul them as they try if they try to cross the river cross the river here. They could try and go south, but if they do, I'll just pull him back. Suisse, some they've got a bit of artillery, but we have more. Sir. 
Ready and awaiting orders. Let's move this guy up. Oh, God alive. Okay, that's... This is the game protecting me from something it now I doesn't want to see. I don't want to see. <laughs> God damn it. This is why they're so happy leaving their capital. So what I want to do is something like this. This way, if they come after me, I can try and intercept them as they cross the river. Or they might head northwest and encircle and destroy these forces. It's possible. It's very possible. Well, let's begin building another army, just in case. So, as we've killed this chap in Palermo, Naples is slowly, there we go, slowly ticking up towards Protestantism, as is Venice. Um, but Venice is because of a priest, but I want to get it, get the religious unrest down, then I'll move the priest on, start to convert Milan and Lombardy. Okay, so let's see what's going to happen. The British are coming. Uh oh. Okay. If I can advance on to the capital. Oh god, they took Vito. <laughs> the Poles are on their way. <laughs> Good. Well, to be honest, that's what I want. Oh, I think they've killed Austria completely. I think they've got Munich. Holy hell. So let's build up the Venice garrison again, just in there case they break through region, our lines. That has not yet been yeah, they've got Munich as well. Select Holy the hell. type of port to construct here. A fishing port will help your population. Let's get this guy up to the area. And so, without doing anything too clever, let's get a bunch of line, two units of guards. So, firepower 42. See, my mort mortars have always been pants, but I'll get them because they're going to be strictly defensive. Let's get some late marines. Oh no, are we gonna... Okay, I'm, I don't oh know. Okay, you could do a recruitment as well. Get two units of grenadier guards. There's more grenadier guards? Yeah, there are more grenadier guards. Okay, then don't get those. Get... Some engineers. Move Tristan Dalton up to Venice. Ready. March. March. Let's not do the Naval College yet. Let's go back over to the Americas. Because we've got good potential for cash and money. 4,000, 3,000, 4,000. Let's give you good roads. Let's help get your stuff to port. Let's upgrade the workshop. I mean, yeah, I'll, get, I'll upgrade the boarding house as well, if you like. They have no walls, so it'd be a pitch battle. Lots of Westphalian chaff. Ready and waiting there is a way to scoot through, I think. I'll do it with these guys first. We can't do that, sir. Oh, they can't. Can't do it, sir. Okay, then don't. Immediately. If I go this way. Impossible, sir. Let's keep them bundled together. Forward. Yes, sir. For crown and country. Your Majesty. Yep, I thought that interception would happen, but it's gotta happen sooner or later. So I want to the artillery army first, like so a former defensive position. Um, then I'll have to drag these guys, such that it's my infantry coming in 
quickly. Let's put some of my cavalry in there. Let's get the sentinels in. Just put some there. Let's put the dreadnoughts in. It's chaff. It's not, and it doesn't include the French garrison, so it's just the Westphalian rubbish and these guys on the in the rear. So let's do it. This could be pretty good. It's hopefully I can do it with one army. Well, I say hopefully. I most likely will. The force is in reserve, ready to lay siege to Paris immediately. Then I'll have to move up Andrew Hamilton as well to help draw off those three French armies that are waiting. See. Uh, dodgy, bold, uh, bit of whiff, iffy terrain. This is a nice little hill for artillery, or for some artillery. The others are going to crawl up on top of this hill. So let's put some guard infantry to protect them. Let's put the bulk of our infantry, probably a little bit more, out where we expect the enemy to come from. Which we might have to advance up a bit, up into their grill. Let's put the howitzers behind this hill. Recovery back because I'm waiting for whatever reinforcements they send in. Oh, it's a stupid cart, isn't it? Yeah. There we go. Might not be the best formation, but it's a formation. Oh no, actually it's okay, first push you up to here. So I moved out my moved out my cavalry to try and knock out their reinforcements a bit prematurely. Artillery. So even though we are we are attacking them notionally, um, they have to really come after us. Otherwise, we'll just pound them to bits. Okay, let's get all my cavalry on this flank. They're pretty vulnerable over here. Get my howitzers to bombard their cavalry. I'm not concerned about their infantry. It's of poor quality. And we fall quickly to our fire by rank. It's mostly just our militia units, so. And they will have reinforcements coming in as and when troops are killed. So I might even stretch these guys out just a little bit more. Well, when we leave them. Let's pull them back. into the cavalry with my with my with my uh, engineers even though they just they just sucked up a whole bunch of grape shot they needed to to protect my cannons spin my artillery around to face them from the threat unlimb for you guys Charge my cavalry into their cavalry. They're marching together towards the nice clumps. Let's get these guys instantly to quit to cast a shot.
Oh, this goes into the melee. So a big melee fight wasn't really what I want. So let's get my artillery to play this unit of land there that are coming back. So the general's bodyguard is doing damage. Especially with all my cavalry tied up in the rear. Successfully diverted. Now it says, in the midst of the cavalry, you guys form an immediate square in a really funky spot. Oh god, no, no, that's as good as that. To, even though they're not in range, to point at the militia reinforcing them. Because this is just silly, whatever the hell this is. So how many. Why are you not. Look, how are you winning? We've got heavy cover, we should be slicing through here. Woods artillery. This is going to be a successful melee charge. So pull the general back to safety. At least this is where the main bulk of the threat comes in. These dregs should be manageable with just these units of line. We could, could probably do limbering guns up and pivoting the whole line just a little bit more. So those units have broken. The drunk of glory are continuing the charge. Forming, so I'm going to form square so I can pivot my cavalry, which might get caught by their cavalry. Nope. Their cavalry is going to hit. I've successfully diverted it. I did most successfully evade my version, but they've got sucked up into the square anyway. You make ready. And the bulk of the reinforcing army aren't going to be a problem, because they're going to come in piecemeal. I just want these guys to route, want these troops to route successfully. Shouldn't have sent both my cavalry off, but there we go. Live and learn. Well, unless you're a PC member of my army. It's a Limber Limberton fire will off. So that's their reinforcements coming in. So let's send you guys over to this flank. Sure. 
I mean, it's surprising how much they've done this, how much damage done to the first horse guards, really. Are coming from Jesus. Hey, General, ride down the Western European mercenaries. Grenadiers get stuck in full line and fall back. Guns back up. Good. Complete. Win. One square, yeah, the square broke almost instantly. Send my heavy cavalry after the general's bodyguard. Third square, you for everyone from square. Chased after the chased after the route and curve. Oh. My troops have bumped into some of their missing light infantry. Well, you killed them, they're only light infantry. Nice 
fire on them as they crest over the hill towards us. Send my heavy cavalry to the, the first light foot. Fire, you can fire over the heads of my men. Okay, go charge into this unit of militia to prevent them from coming back. Just out of range of cast shot, but I'll still risk a few shots. Here come the dreadnoughts. Pull my guard cavalry back. anything to them. They're all going to hell. We can fire cast shot into this big blob of Westphalian troops. Sentinels are moving south. Break them. Break them with the traitorous dogs they are. Because they will break. Here's the drummer or the bugler. Some up. Holds all artillery fire. And this major opens with someone to kill. Oh god! Engage the artillery fire. There, down, they've come back. Pull back all of my cavalry. Your job is done. 